The U.S. Army is rewriting the rules of modern warfare, not in Washington, but on the training grounds of California and the jungles of Hawaii. Newly reorganized units are getting cutting-edge drones and counter-drone tech, sometimes just days before they deploy into massive exercises. Soldiers are learning, breaking, fixing, and flying all at once. In Hawaii, one unit watched its drone slam into a tree after a battery glitch. Minutes later, it was repaired and back in the fight. Out here, power isn't just equipment. As one officer put it, power is the new weapon system. The Army's moving fast, gifting heavy units into lighter, more flexible formations and rolling out drones that can scout targets, guide artillery, or strike on their own. Each exercise reveals what works, what fails, and what needs to change. AI is entering the mix too. Tools that map the battlefield, simulate threats, or draft orders in seconds instead of hours. And 3D printing labs are already building custom army-designed drones, including one that recently dropped a live munition for the first time. But the message is clear. The enemy will have these tools as well. One soldier learned that the hard way when a casual social post allowed officers to track him instantly a reminder that every signal is a vulnerability. Now, drone-on-drone -drone battles with hundreds of aircraft in the sky are becoming the norm, a preview of future conflicts in the Indo-Pacific. The mission hasn't changed, take and hold ground. But tanks and infantry will now fight alongside autonomous systems built for a faster, more unpredictable battlefield.